Good afternoon, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to um, the book launch of um, Ms. Kark and wonderful, wonderful book. Uh, on behalf of the publishers, Roly Books, I'm going to be brief uh, this afternoon, but uh, the book speaks for itself. It's um, really a, a, quite an achievement uh, to have, in such a short time, uh, Bina Ji has, uh, you know, taken pictures which are close, better than professional uh, photographs. And <laughs> it's really, really a proud uh, moment for Roly Books to, to publish this book. We are very, very um, happy with it. This afternoon um, is really a testament to um, Bina Ji, to all of her well-wishers, friends who are here to launch this book. Uh, thank you all for being here. Like I said, I'll be very short. The book speaks for itself. I don't need to say anything more. Uh, so please, please, please do grab a copy of the book. Uh, it's really a wonderful, wonderful book. Thank you so much. Thank you. At this time, I would request uh, Dr. Kamal Murarka to please come up on stage and say a few words. Mr. Murarka is uh, one of the best champions. I'll be very brief, but I must say a few things. My association with Bina first. I first met her in 1984, 33 years ago. I was contesting for the Rajya Sabha from Rajasthan, and I was 38. She must have been the same age, little younger maybe. And uh, <laughs> and uh, each vote counts. She was an MLA, and uh, she was in the Congress. We were in the opposition, not BJP. Janta Dal, etc. So in the lunch time, all the youngsters, they all get out her and said, quietly give a vote to Kamal, who will find out. She said, no thank you, you people want me to be expelled from my party, I'm not going to do that. That was my, since 84, continuously, she and I have been friends, we have been in touch, every few months, every few, whatever occasion. Wildlife, I started with Bharatpur Bird Sanctuary, Siberian Cranes. They intrigued me, so I went there to take their pictures. I think I've got a picture with the last pair of Siberian cranes that have come to India. Now they've become extinct. Then in 2002 was my first brush with the tiger in Bandhavgarh. The kind of tiger pictures I got, I never expected. The lesson that I've learned from wildlife, of course I can't speak for Mike Pandey is here, Belendu is here, but I must give you my feeling, and that is, Definitely, whom we call wild animals are more gentle, more sincere than any of us. Human beings store food for months and years. A tiger kills a deer till he finishes that deer two days. He doesn't kill another deer. He doesn't kill for pleasure. He kills for food. We human beings kill for pleasure, which shows we are wild, they are not wild. We are calling them wild. Last, Salman, of course, like everybody, I am also his fan. People younger to him are his fans, people older to him are his fans. But what touched me most about him is, apart from his acting, I don't want to speak, I thought I was a quiet philanthropist. Do something good and not make a noise about it. Till I found out he's a quieter philanthropist. He is helping so many people in so many ways, medically and otherwise, nobody knows. That is really good. I am proud of that. Keep it up, sir. Let's hope the, you all enjoy the release of this book. And I look forward to getting a copy of this book. I don't know how. Okay, thank you. Uh, now, it's my honor to invite uh, the author, Shrimati Bina Kak, to please come up on the stage and please uh, accompany Mr. Salim Khan.
when I'm in, in Ranthambore, I can talk till the tigers come home, but here I will let Mrs. Bina Kak, please, to address all of us and tell us about your book. Good evening, everyone. So normally, is tarah ki to jo kitabein hoti hain, they are written by, or published, compiled by wildlife experts, professional photographers, and wildlife enthusiasts. This book is by a novice. When I started holding the camera, I wasn't an expert and I still not. And it is by a woman minister who was given this responsibility of looking after forests and environment. During my two terms as minister, we worked hard to improve the ecology of the jungles, Ranthambor, to create synergies between wildlife, tourism, and well-being of the communities living around the forests. With our collective efforts, we succeeded. As Balindji you would know, we started with 25 tigers and close monitoring, supervising. There are now uh, 70 tigers there. When I was given the charge of this Ministry of Forest and Environment, I grabbed it with both my hands. That is what took me to this fascinating world of forests and wildlife. There, it was love at first sight love with the forest, the tigers, and all forms of life there, the habitat, ecology. That love made me pick up a camera for the first time in my life. Photography first became a hobby, then a passion, and now it's become like a sickness. I keep looking for frames, either with my professional camera and now with my mobile phone cameras also. I mean, it's honestly like a sickness, like my daughter tells me that this is still a sickness. The latest subject has been Salman Khan in the flight above the clouds. <laughs> so if he's sitting in front of me, anything that sort of catches my attention, I just cannot stop. So, bear with me, please. <laughs> Mike Pandey, my friend, my guru, my guide, was the first to push me towards photography. It was he who told me what equipment to buy, how to press the button, how to click, how to make frames. And he encouraged me like a bache ko jaise koi khilona mil jata hai aur wo phir dhoonta hai ki kis tarah se ise kaam mein liye hai. And I used to be so passionate about each picture I would send to him. Matlab ek kahani likh ke uska jawaab aata tha ki kya matlab wo tasveer kaisi bhi hoti hogi. But he would just go on about that picture, you know. So I thought, this is very good. And then I want, became greedy. I wanted to do better and better and better. There were two other people. Desh Bandhu, who is not here today. He is in uh, Ranthambore. And Balindu Singh Ji, who helped me with the nitty gritties of uh, photography, cameras, and Madhu Bhavisa, who is sitting there, used to feed me. Ab subha chhe baje mera khana banke chala jata tha because she would not know ke mera wapis kab aungi. Fifty degrees garmi ke andar sitting eight hours for one tiger. You know, I just get carried away. There was a tiger once, and we felt it was um, standing in the bushes. Ten minute huye, pandra minute huye, wo khada hi raha. और निकल ही नहीं रहा था। डेढ़ या दो घंटे के बाद पता चला कि वो तो बैठा हुआ था। And we realized that it is the largest tiger in Nantambur. So I wanted to photograph that tiger. You won't believe for eight hours that tiger did not come out. 
एंड वी वॉज सिटिंग दे सर में पानी डाल रहे हैं ठंडा कर रहे हैं अपने आप को बट दैट इज दी पैशन Balindu Banar's knowledge about jungles also and habitat was like a boon, and their love, Mike, Desh Bandhu, Balindu, Rahul Bhatnagar is here from the forest department here. That sort of rubbed me off. So, kabi kabi ye shock hobby junoon ban jata hai aur junoon zindagi ban jati aur Rumi bhai wohi mere saath hua. The knowledge, knowledgeable. experienced and wildlife loving forest department drivers like um, i would start with drivers not the higher ups ranjit who was with me for almost 10 years driving me around he knew more than all of you ha jitne bhi aap ifs baithe hain more than you all ranjit knew abhay singh my driver forest officers like mr soni mr brar mr reddy mr sahu rahul bhatnagar many others guided and taught me at every step all of them have been my gurus guided me at every step and i salute all of them my love for the tigers and passion for photography has been also life giving i was detected with breast cancer it was during those long and difficult months of undergoing chemotherapy and radiation This is the first time I'm talking about it. That I started and editing these photographs. Thought about sharing my feelings with photos with others. This kept me connected with life, and it became my lifeline. And here I am, happy and kicking. मैं बागों के कुंबे के बारे में अपने बारे में सोचती रहती थी. सब बागों के रिश्तों का पता था. कौन किसका बेटा है कौन किसकी माँ है कौन किसकी बहनें हैं सो दिस इज वेयर आई हैव कैप्चर दी फैमिलीज ऑफ रनथम्बोर फैमिलीज इन रनथम्बोर फोटोग्राफी photography taught me to be patient to just wait to accept what i got all very important life skills going to the forest for me like a de- detox regime and it became it's like meditation when you are focusing on one subject for hours you forget about the rest of the world so this is what they say meditation karo maine kaha main bahut karti hu jungle mein ja ke my sister kamla and i first did a book for children called sultan ka jungle it is published in nine languages by tulika books and uh, that is about one mother and son tiger pe noor and sultan and now this book is for children and adults i am grateful to roli books Mr Pramod Kapoor his daughter Priya Kapoor for publishing this book and bearing with a person who had no clue about getting the books done to unhe bhi bahut pareshan kiya kabhi chapter nahi gaya to kabhi tasveer nahi kai to kabhi editing theek nahi hui so it took me about 3 years to come out with this book i am beholden to all my gurus whom i have already named for their guidance support and encouragement I'm very grateful to my young friend Yusuf Ansari for helping me with the text and his expert input without which this book would not have been and uh, Archana for being there whenever I got stuck anywhere Sorry Archana really bothered you a lot Aaj subah bhi tang kar rahi thi ki tweet ke liye photo bana de I feel totally blessed by his holiness the Dalai Lama there could not have been anyone better than him to write a foreword and to remind us of the interdependence between all the sentient beings and the urgency to live more ecologically kamal morar ka ji vijay kalanti bhai and your team you have been more than generous in hosting 
and organizing this event. It was just a phone call and all was done. Thank you very much, Vikas, your team. Last but not the least, Salman, my friend, my brother, like son. I'm glad and grateful to have you in my life and to have you here today to release this book. It's all about an awareness to protect tigers. You have always stood by me like a rock Salman, like a brother, not like a rock star. You have given me a new dream and added a new as aspect to my life that is films. Salim Saab, Salma Ji, Helen, and all the other family members for their love and support. Fortunate are those who have this amazing family in their lives, and I'm one of them. Thank you very much. Thank you, Katrina, for taking time for me. That's lovely. I know you're busy with promotions, Ali, your team, and I thank all of you who have taken the time to be here today to share this very important day in my life. In the end, I dedicate this book to my grandchildren Kabir and Jawahar and the next generation hoping that they all live in love, peace and harmony amongst themselves and Mother Nature. Tiger Zinda hai or Tiger Zinda rahega. Ali, best of luck with your film. It has been granted certificate hamara. Mil gaya hai, so all the best to you and your team. Thank you very much, friends from the press, for coming here. Thank you all. Thank you, Shera, and your team. Thank you very much. Uh, may I request Choti uh, Baisa, Ms. Amrita Khak. Junjunwala to please come and present bouquets to the guests on the dais. It's uh, Bina ji was saying that you know she's blessed and she's fortunate she was able to do this book, but an artist par excellence, she also knows that there are no retakes in wildlife photography. <laughs> Send copies of the book to the author, Ms. Kark, and to Mr. Salman Khan, Mr. Mike Pandey, Mr. Morarka, and Mr. Kalantri.
this time I request uh, Mr. Mike Fande, one of the greatest wildlife photographers that we have in our country today, to please come up on the stage and say a few words. Experiences. How about docu documenting them? And that's where the journey started. And uh, the book, I think, personally, is titled wrongly. It should be called The Silent Love Affair of Bina Kak with Nature. <laughs> because I have been filming wildlife. I live in the jungles and the highest mountains and the most dangerous places, and even tigers. But when Bina Kak used to come into the jungle, we, we were there sitting for about eight to ten hours, no tigers, and suddenly tigers start training. They used to appear from everywhere. So that's why I'm saying it's a love affair. Wherever she went, the tigers were there. And if you look at this picture, a tigress is most dangerous when it has its cub. She'll kill to protect them. But there's not even a grimace on this tigress's face. So it shows the type of affinity, the connect Bina Kak had with wild animals, with nature. And several times, because of her photography, she could zoom in and even detect worms in a tigress. And immediately, the forest department was there. It saved, removed, operated the tigress and saved its life. So this comes from a journey of compassion. We are the only species on this planet that has the ability to process information. Why make a film on tigers? Why make a photograph? Book, photo book on photography on tigers. The earth we live in and upon is in serious trouble today. All of you sitting here have a connect with the tiger. And what's the connect? You all drink fresh water. 67% of the fresh water on this planet comes from our forests, recycled, purified. 87% of the food that we eat, the fruits that we eat, and we never think of the honeybee, the butterfly, and five insects that pollinate $14 trillion worth of food and food grains on the planet. Without them, we cannot survive. If the bee dies, we will be dead, we'll be wiped out within one year. How many of us think about that? There have to be people like Bina who bring out this book to generate awareness so that you look at it, motivate, inspire you to protect what nature created so that we could live in peace. We cannot live in isolation. We are the weakest species on this planet. And it's only when you understand the value of each creature nature created that you will protect it. And believe me, we need an intact nature and not a fragmented, fractured world which we have done. Our activities have destroyed the world. Climate change, polluted water, all is affecting us. And the water in Delhi, for example, it's got millions and millions times more mercury and cadmium, even in Bombay, and which is injuring your brain, your bodies. But somebody has health is the most precious thing on this planet. Money cannot create even a drop of water. So I think more needs to be done. I told Bina, this is her first work. This is the appetizer, the bigger world is waiting out there. Many doors have opened for her. And I'm really very happy today that it has the backing of Salman and Katrina is here. It needs the stalwarts of my country to push the cause of nature. The earth is the mother. It's a mother of millions of species, like your own mother gave life and form to you. The earth has given form, ensures that millions of species live in harmony. But today it is in danger, it is in trouble. And work like this are the catalysts that will change the world. So I request support from all of you and every single one. No rules can save the tiger. No laws can protect the tiger. It's only when people change, then things change. And you, every single one of you, have to take the step. And only then change will occur. I still believe I made a few films which brought about legislation and changes in the country uh, and all the, in the world also. And I still believe cinema is the most powerful medium 
to reach out to people. And I, 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 I won't talk much about it because you can see Salman's film when they come. There is a volcano eruption all across the country. So cinema reaches to the extreme ground, ground roots, grassroot levels, touches the minds and souls and the heart of people, and change can happen. We want change. We want the world to change. We need more Bina Kaks. We need more Salman Khans. And the future, today, I think, we need to sensitize our youngsters who are so involved in technology and all that, they've forgotten the emotional quotient is going out. The connect is breaking out. We have to reconnect to the earth, which enables millions of species, seven billion of us, to survive. Is it fair that 70 billion livestock creatures, animals are killed every year to feed a handful of people? That's how many animals, 70 billion. Our population is only 7 billion. But 70 billion animals are farmed and killed and slaughtered. And that has created greenhouse gases, which is tipping the balance of the planet. I see that we need to make a film, definitely, here's a hint, which reaches out to the youth of the country, to the people, sensitize, tell them when they know the meaning of each creature, the value each life form brings, then only will transformation take place. And we need to make a difference. And films will make a difference. And books like these are the catalysts. So I'm really grateful to all of you for being here and to Bina for bringing out this book and Rolly Books. I think Rolly Books have done a great job and uh, I keep staring at this front picture. And I am hoping that one day I'll meet a tigress with a baby who just gives me a loving look rather than a, a snarl. Thank you. Thank you, Mike. Uh, in fact, uh, it is through books like these and films uh, people like Mike make that we know and we know how to care about animals. We cannot go to school and learn about animals. It has to be done in the field. It is now my honor to request uh, Mr. Salim Khan to please come up and say a few words. I want to ask you to say something नहीं नहीं उसकी एक वजह है उसकी एक वजह है कि पहले आजकल कभी भी कोई आता है डिमांड आता है किसी फंक्शन का तो सब में पहले पूछा जाता है कि सर 15 तारीख को सलमान खान साहब क्या कर रहे हैं मैंने कहा वो 15 तारीख को यहां है नहीं वो बाहर है आउट ऑफ कंट्री है सब अरबाज भाई क्या कर रहे हैं मैंने कहा अरबाज भाई हैं शूटिंग कर रहे हैं सोहेल भाई 15 तारीख को अवेलेबल हैं मैंने कहा नहीं वो भी उनके साथ ही शूटिंग कर रहे हैं Sir, what is Helen Ji? Helen Ji will get 15 years ago. I said, no. Actually, sir, we were calling you. Thank 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 you. Wish you all the best, Vina Ji. And this book is the book. ये बीना जी ने नहीं लिखी है ये इट इज रिटन बाय अ टाइग्रेस कॉल्ड बीना काक आई रिक्वेस्ट मिस कैटरीना कैफ टू प्लीज कम अप एंड से अ फ्यू वर्ड्स वेल Okay, so I'm not prepared for this, but um, all I really would like to say is I've known um, Bina Ji for a very long time, and she really is like almost like a member. I, well, I'm like a member of her family. I think um, I don't think I've met a more wonderful, sweet, warm, and welcoming person. And I think it's absolutely amazing what you're doing with this book. And uh, I really encourage everyone to go out there and read it because if Bina Ji is doing something like this, and you can be assured that it's for a very good reason and will really be amazing. Thank you so much, and thank you for having me here, Rina Ji. <laughs> it is my honor now to invite uh, Mr. Salman Khan sir, to please come up. To Say <laughs> correct cheese to Katrina bol ke gayi ke jaave kitab khari do. I endorse karti hu us par. 
अच्छा हमें समझ में नहीं आ रहा कि हम यहाँ पे टाइगर जिंदा है की प्रमोशन करने आए हैं या <laughs> या बीना बाजी का बुक लॉन्च करने आए हैं ये एक्चुअली पहले भी हुआ था जब अली और मैं सुल्तान कर रहे थे तो आ, हम लोग रंथम जाने वाले थे वो एक एक, एक सुल्तान टाइगर जिस, जिसके ऊपर आपने किताब निकाली थी तो वो तो हुआ नहीं फिर पता नहीं टा, एक था टाइगर के बाद टाइगर जिंदा जिंदा है आ गई और इनकी किताब भी एक सेम टाइम पर लॉन्च होने वाली थी वंच लॉन्च होने वाली थी तो कॉन्सिडेंटली तो ये हो गया दोनों के बेनिफिट में ये आ गया और इस इस विषय पे मैं जितना कम बात करूँ उतना अच्छा है मेरे लिए बट uh, मैं आई टोटली एग्री विथ विथ कमल जी के वाइल्ड एनिमल बहुत जेंटल होता है uh, <laughs> जी मोर देन ह्यूमन बींग्स एस आई टोटली एग्री विद डैट वन हंड्रेड परसेंट और सर माई पांडे सर आपने बीना बाजी को बहुत अच्छे एडवाइस दिए हैं कि टाइगर के बाद पैंथर पैंथर के बाद लोमड़ी लोमड़ी के बाद बी बी तो आई थिंक हर साल हमको यहाँ पर होना पड़ेगा और मेरी लाइफ बी बी एम पर बर्बाद हो जाएगी क्योंकि जब जब बीना बाजी जाती हैं फॉरेस्ट फॉरेस्ट में तो वहाँ से कुछ पचास तस्वीरें मुझे रोज़ आ जाती हैं हाँ कि ये कैसा है ये कैसा है पहले तो बहुत अच्छा है बहुत अमेजिंग है इनक्रेडिबल बहुत लंबे लंबे वापस से जाते थे टेक्स्ट दिस इज सुपर फिर हुआ वेरी नाइस फिर हुआ नाइस फिर फिर हुआ के ये है तो आई थिंक नेक्स्ट ईयर आई थिंक इस इसी समय पर अगर अली या कभी ने डिसाइड किया कि लोमड़ी जिंदा है या कुछ बिल्ली का अटैक कोई ऐसी कोई पिक्चर डिसाइड किया तो उसके लिए आ जाएंगे हम लोग यहाँ पर थैंक यू वेरी मच एंड आई थिंक इट्स अ ग्रेट बुक बिकॉज आई सीन ऑल द पिक्चर्स मच बिफोर दे हैव रिलीज विच आई जस्ट मैंशन एंड यस सो आई विल नॉट टेक एनी क्रेडिट अगर तारीफ नहीं हुई तो इस किताब की बट आई एम श्योर दैट दिस बुक I've seen all the pictures and I've seen them you know when she shot them and um uh, they they're really really nice and really beautiful and thank you and uh, tiger zinda hai aur zinda rahega inshallah hamesha I request Mr Vijay Kalan 3 to give a vote of thanks We are grateful to Bina Ji for giving us an opportunity to launch this book today. Genuinely, the book is very good because we are seeing going through some of the photographs and all. Bina Ji, wish you all the best. We are grateful to Salman Khan for coming here to launch the book along with Madam Katrina Kaif. So I wish him all the best for his new forthcoming film also. Of course, Morarka Foundation always comes forward to do all these good things as and when we launch. This is the third book we are launching in last two years. We had launched last was. uh satukan sinas book in the same hotel and this is the second book this year we are launching so we are grateful to all of them who has given an opportunity salim bhai you and your family for being here with us and spending your valuable time and mr mike pande and friends and all the media and the audience who is here with us because i think all have spoken about the book i did not but thank you very much and thank you for coming here thank you I uh, invite all the guests to please join us for high tea at this moment thank you very much